Greetings YouTube viewers and subscribers. You may ask, what the heck do I have going on here? Well, what I've got is the camshaft cover and bearing from an OSFS 120 uh, pre-surpass engine here that I've just disassembled. And for instructional purposes and for my education, I have never actually replaced camshaft bearings on any OS engine because to my knowledge they're stainless steel and I've never seen one that goes bad. But I have heard of a method of getting this bearing out of this and the crankshaft by just using wax and pressing wax into, into the cavity here. So that's what I'm going to do. All I've got here is I found a candle of my wife's, a razor blade. Hopefully she won't miss that candle. And I've shaved off some candle wax. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start filling this cavity with wax and press it down. And I'm just using an Allen key or a metric wrench that fills, that kind of pushes or fits in that hole pretty well. I'm just going to keep pushing wax in here. Now this is not something I've ever done before. I've only heard about it as far as it working. So we'll see what happens here. And the idea is you just keep pushing wax into that cavity and it's supposed to push this bearing out. Now I haven't heated this up or anything. This is just cold wax that I'm trying to press in here. To me it looks like what's happening is the wax is starting to kind of push out from around my uh, and uh, see what happens here. I'm trying to push this in there. Now I'm sure a wood dowel would work too of the proper size. Let's see what's happening here is this wax just looks like it keeps getting pushed out from around that. So I think the key to this operation is that you have to have a presser or pusher there that's really the right size. Now I'm not seeing that it's lifting this bearing out at all, but it may just also be that this takes a lot longer than I'm anticipating. So I'm just going to keep trying to do this and see what happens here. Now if you look closely, it does look like, let's see if my camera will refocus, it looks like it is starting to push that bearing out a little bit at a time. So I'm just, I've got some pretty fine, fine, uh, particles here of wax. I'm just going to keep pressing that in there and hopefully here eventually this uh, bearing will come out. And there you have it. Sure enough, that method works, and it works quite well. Now, I wasn't really planning on replacing this bearing, so now I've got to find some means to clean this damn thing off and clean all this out. But, you can see that a plug comes out just like that, and that is an effective means for removing these camshaft bearings. Now obviously the same thing can be done on the inside of the engine. If this bearing feels bad, I'll probably pull it out on that side of the engine and do it also. So 
There you go, a demonstration of how to remove a camshaft bearing.